Hey folks, it's Matt. Yeah, as you can tell with my face, I uh, haven't been having much of a week. Been having these bad allergy stuff trying to get over. And of course, more shit news. I got fucking ripped off. Now, I enjoy the movie, but I had a. I bought the other day, or a few days ago, I did an update saying I bought this. I had not opened it yet. And then earlier today, I opened this because I was going to watch this maybe during the after the weekend or maybe Monday. I'll give this a watch. Then I get a message. From a very nice guy named Ali McNabb. If I said your name wrong, I apologize. Nice guy on Facebook. He's like, man, I saw your video from a few days ago. I noticed you got kidnapped on Blu-ray. And I said, yeah. He's like, well, do you notice the running time? Because when it was in the theater, it was an hour and 35 minutes. But on the Blu-ray and DVD, it's like an hour and... 21 minutes and change. I'm like, what? Popped it in. He's right. I'm like, what the fuck? And then I'm thinking, well, just to confirm that I'm not going crazy, what's some of the stuff that was cut out? And he's like, well, opening scenes of, there's pictures of her baby, that was that was cut down and I flipped through it and I went yeah that's a bit shorter than I remember seeing in the theater and such the cafe scene a little bit shortened yeah I noticed there was seemed like less shots of the the bitchy blonde lady giving a bit of a hard time and then he's like well there's a scene where Halle Berry first confronts this kidnapper he pulls out a knife and she backs up the car as he's running after her and then she stops when he stops <clears throat> and I watch I'm like yeah that section of that scene's cut out he's like well another scene is when she goes to this police tosses this police officer and then she picks up the phone and she tossed her husband I'm like I remember that scene it's not in here that bit was cut out. And there's more, because I must to because that was this is about an hour and twenty-one and change, and that's about hour and thirty-five and change. So really about oh I don't know, fourteen fucking minutes cut out of the goddamn movie I saw in the I loved it. I'm one of the only people on the fucking earth that enjoyed the film and wanted to get this and bought it. And I wasted 20 goddamn dollars. And if you're wondering, yes, the Blu-ray and DVD are an hour and 21 minutes and about 45 seconds. And I had to fucking do this. I knew that when I saw it, it was, wait, this is about an hour and 34, hour and 35 minutes, so I had to go find a fucking stream online, and yep, it was an hour and 35 fucking minutes. So, what well, you're trying to tell me, universal, unifuckle, you shit on my ass, on my face, in your face, up your fucking dick hole, you piece of cock sucking motherfucking cum eating, cum dribbling, ass spanking, Butt fucking, butt plugging, cum smearing, smoking, motherfucking piece of fucking garbage, shithead, cocksucker, that I just wasted 20 goddamn dollars of my fucking money when I could have gotten other stuff. Hell, I should have, yeah, you know what? I, I, I'm sorry that I fucking followed the rules, Universal. I enjoyed your fucking movie when everyone was hating on it. I enjoyed the fucking flick. One of the only fucking people on YouTube. Probably the only fucking person on YouTube that gave it a positive review. And you fucked me over. And for those wondering, look closely. Does this say any alter version? 
Blu-ray, DVD, and digital. From the producers of Salt and Transformers, Halle Berry includes digital, plays on your mobile devices, Kidnap, no, no director's cut, or no alternate cut, or quicker cut, or 14 minutes fucking missing cut. Let's look on the back. HD picture and theater quality sound. Not for the fucking minutes that are missing. Uh, typical, let's see, we're going to the plot. Typical afternoon, the part turns into a nightmare for single mom Carla Dyson. Cami Award winner Halle Berry when her son suddenly event disappears. Without a cell phone and knowing she has no time to wait for police help, Carla jumps in her own car and sets off in pursuit of the kidnappers. A relentless edge of your seat chase ensues where Carla must risk everything to not lose sight of her son. In this tense action field thriller from the producers of Salt and Transformers, one mother's heroic attempt to take back her son's leads her to ask herself how far will she go to save her child. Bonus feature. A thrilling behind the scenes look beside look inside kidnap. Digital or watch on iTunes. Watch it anywhere. Instantly stream and download on your TV, computer, tablet, smartphone. Universal. Universal Pictures Home Entertainment. 10 Universal City Plaza. Universal City CA. 91608. 2017 Universal Studios. All rights reserved. Restricted R violence and peril. Under 17 requires accompanying parent or adult guardian. UPHE.com. Averon 207-8908, www.copyprotected.com. Hashtag 2001 Best Actress Monsters Ball Academy Awards Registered Trademark and Service Mark at the Academy of Motion Picture Arts and Sciences. Bonus feature not rated, not all subtitle, redemption code subject to expiration. Visit NBCCodes.com for details. Internet connection required. Download capability varies by device, transfer, or resale of redemption code prohibited. I read you everything on the fucking back. You know what else it doesn't say on the back? The fucking running time. Yeah, I'm sorry. I didn't fuck with the, the package. I didn't fuck with the thing and get myself in trouble. But then look over here and oh yeah. Yep, it says an hour and 22 minutes. This is an hour and 21 minutes and 45 seconds. I'm like, wait a minute. No way. There's some... That's like... By that, yeah, it's about 13 minutes missing. But I remember it'd be like hour 35 and some change. So about, yeah, 14 minutes missing. That's not like one minute or 30 seconds or half a minute or two minutes. 13 to 14 fucking minutes missing. And now that it's opened, because I opened it earlier, and God forbid, you have no running time on the back here. Here. No running back. No running time. There's no running time there. I read you everything. Oh, but if I do this and, you know... And do you see any alternate... Did I name anything about an alternate cut, director's cut, uh, faster cut, studio cut, pussy cut, cocksucker cut, slut, fuck? And I can't return this now because I already opened it earlier in the fucking day because I like the movie. So, I, yeah, wasted 20 goddamn dollars of my money on a fucking paperweight. Because no, you know what I'm going to have to fucking do? I'm going to have to try, if I can, find the fucking movie online, try to download it if I fucking can, if it's available anywhere to download, and then try to burn on a fucking DVD-R if I can, because it doesn't work, doesn't fucking work. And then if I'm able to do it, it's going to be shitty picture quality anyway. It'll probably have dots and shit on it, because this is a fucking over 10 year old laptop computer and I don't burn many movies because I buy movies you've seen my updates you've seen my go back to my DVD and Blu-ray collection I have a lot of fucking movies that I fucking buy and then what the ticker you know what was ironic when I put the thing in I was looking over his comments once again Ali McNabb if I said your name wrong I would have noticed it once I put the fucking movie in and saw the running time. Like, wait a minute. But he gave me a heads up. He should work for those fucking Blu-ray review companies. Because I dare you to find one review, one piece of information on the internet that mentions that this has about 14 fucking minutes cut from the theatrical release. That you can find online... If you have to go do that, I didn't think I fucking had to do that. And you know what's ironic? You know what's before this? A fucking piracy warning! Don't pirate!
Oh, here's another, here's a better one. Don't rip people the fuck off! Who fucking pay their money to support your fucking ass! I'm sorry I didn't have a hundred million people to come with me to see Kidnap when it was in theaters and give it, well, what, force them to give positive reviews? I still enjoy the movie. I don't blame the movie. It's not like it's Halle Berry's fault or the actor's fault or whatever. It's the fucking studio I blame. <clears throat> and I'm rip I got ripped off. There's no clearer case of being ripped off than here right now. I don't even know how to towel it. Uh, Universal ripped me off. Uh, 14 minutes missing from Kidnap Blu-ray. Don't buy it. This is a, yeah, it's a public service announcement. Don't fucking buy it. Don't fucking buy it. Why are you buying something and they're not even telling you it? They're not even mentioning it to you? No fucking reviews online. No fucking reviews anywhere. I saw the fucking movie, I know how long it fucking was, I have another person who can confirm it to me. I know no one else saw it, so maybe all these motherfuckers who get paid to review Blu-rays, they get paid for it. They actually get fucking paid for this shit, and they didn't fucking notice. Did you look at Blu-ray reviews? Oh yeah, the movie's this and that. Yeah, there's like a three, four minute feature ad, blah, blah, blah. Hey, how about mentioning that there's 14 fucking minutes missing? You stupid cocksuckers. And you're getting paid for this? Ali Benab, nice guy on Facebook, he should get paid for it. He did a better job than you motherfuckers did. And I would have noticed too, so pay me for that shit. So yeah, don't buy this fucking Blu-ray. Don't buy it. Because you're not getting the full movie. I shouldn't have to be doing this. Maybe go on Pirate Bay. Maybe go on this. Oh, Pirate. You ripped me off, you fucking stupid, shitty studio. And you're not even mentioning it to anybody. To anybody. Don't believe me? Go online. That's why you'll find some places say this was 94, 95 minutes. Then you have some places say, well, it's 82 minutes. Well, let's, you know what? Yeah, you go on Wikipedia, of course. I looked at, that says 82 minutes now. It didn't used to do, do that. It used to be 95 minutes. But I'm curious, if I go to Google, if I go to Google, sorry, I'm getting just fucking infuriated, pissed off, angry. I look like I got a fucking pepperoni all over my goddamn face because this fucking goddamn cut sucking allergy suck my fucking ball sass put this goddamn bottle up the fucking asshole but they probably fucking like it not that there's anything wrong if you like it so actually, I take that back. If you don't like it, then I'll we'll shove this up that fucking pie hole that you call an ass, that you talk out of. And that's why bullshit's flying out. Fucking fascist. Fucking fascist. Fucking. If I go to Google, and if I type in kidnap 2017 running time. And that fucking has to load. This is an hour and 35 fucking minutes right there. If I go on IMDb, what does it say on IMDb? I typed in kidnap 2017 running time. It said an hour and 35 minutes. So I'm not going fucking crazy. That fucking snot coming out like a motherfucking river. People are like, yo, you're going over the top. I'm going over top? I Go on IMDb. 
type in kidnap it says an hour and 35 minutes right there and this is an hour and 22 minutes and they rounded things up so it's less than an hour and 22 and it's more than an hour and 35 so technically it's about 14 minutes bell they want to round it up fine 13 minutes whatever the fuck go again go look on blu-ray reviews they'll mention it's an hour and 22 20 some minutes go on IMDb says an hour and 35 minutes Alan Manab is not lying I'm not fucking lying they ripped you off and they not even telling it to your face hence a ripoff I guess so you're telling me that I spent 20 goddamn dollars and oh yeah in case you're wondering in case you're fucking wondering here you go official says I opened this earlier because I'm sorry I didn't think a studio would rip you off that way I know considering I'm supposed to be the cynical one I actually trusted motherfuckers like Universal and this is what you fucking did I can't return it you can't, when you open it you can't return it they don't let you do that so yeah twenty dollars down the drain fuck I mean I could have fucking spent that on the stuff on my wish list down aka the shaft or blue underground just blue underground actually you know what the fuck they're doing or stream factory you know what I've bitched about stream factory but fuck man nothing to the point of this even they haven't fucked up like this that'd be like releasing John Carver's The Thing not letting people know that they released the fucking TV version and that's the only one on there we're not going to advertise it here's the thing on blu-ray that when people buy it, it's the TV version we're not even going to advertise it 13 14 minutes cut out this fucking movie so now studio universal if somehow I wish I could contact someone I wish to God but who am I going to contact universal don't give a fuck about us what the is the director out there hey director uh, Luis Prito Pri, Prito I actually liked your fucking movie how come I got ripped off can you answer me that huh can you give me an answer is that okay sorry I'm not made of money I'm not fucking rich twenty goddamn dollars might not mean much to Universal but it means it to people like us the common blue collar guys they just want to sit back and enjoy a fucking movie and not be fucking ripped off by cock sucking companies fooling your ass. What's next? Oh, I really like Blade Runner. Uh, that's a different company, but so when Blade Runner comes out, will that be? Oh, you, here's a, here's the two hour cut of the movie. Wait a minute, I thought it was like two hours and forty some minutes. I remember that in the theater. Oh, sorry. When you buy the Blu-ray, it's two hours. Is that going to be it? Is, more companies don't do this shit. I guess it makes sense why they didn't have the fucking running time on the back of the god this cover. No, back of this cover where there's more shit down below. But on the back of this cover, no running time. Nothing that says an alternate version. Nothing on the side, alternate version. And again, both the Blu-ray and DVD, it's an hour and 22 minutes. Hour and 21 minutes, about 45 seconds. So yeah, I got ripped off. $20 just got taken from me and flossed on my ass. And it stuffed in my mouth. And that's why this tastes like shit. And let me ask you, why is it that not enough that one fucking person on fucking line has mentioned this? They either can't do their fucking job, they don't know what the fuck they're doing, and yet Ali now, man, you deserve the money that these motherfuckers are getting. Give me the fucking money too. So now even though you had this fucking piracy warning behind you before you think oh piracy is not a victimless crime you know what is a crime ripping people off what's those steams pygmy pansy 
Pine me. What the fuck is it? Those schemes. I forget the actual terminology for it. Pine me, pig me. Pansy, pinesy schemes. They give you money. You think you did one thing. You did a different thing. You get tricked. They tricked my ass. As a guy in Beverly Hills Cop says. Who tricked my ass? Universal tricked my ass. Again, it's not like it's 30 seconds that got cut. It's fucking 14 minutes of the fucking movie. And it's nowhere, nowhere advertised, not on the Blu-ray, nowhere. I mean, I guess I could title this, you know, I got, you know, 14 minutes missing out of kidnapped Blu-ray. I got ripped off. It's going to be a long-ass title, but you know what? I, I have to put it. I wish there was a way to contact someone. I really do. This is, this is literally the biggest bullshit I've seen in the longest time. This is... Can't say illegal, but you would think there'd be some kind of thing. False advertising? If that's that fucking false advertising, what the fuck is? Well, you got a kidnapped Blu ray. Great. So, I guess if you buy a movie, you might not get the whole movie, but you, hey, at least you got part of the movie. My head just sounded like a fucking cue ball. It looks like a cue ball, and it sounds like a cue ball. Actually, you know what? This is from allergies. This is from my knocking my head against the fucking desk. Right at the point. This one. <sighs> Gotta make myself a black eye. That's what I did. Pounding my fucking senses in. Do it a couple more times, then maybe I'll fall asleep without being too pissed off. So again, you're trying to tell me with all your fucking piracy warnings, I have to, if, hypothetically, if I want the movie that I saw in the theaters, that I thought I was getting, that you did not, you tricked my ass, no fucking advertising that it's 14 minutes missing, if I want that. The version that I enjoyed and gave a positive fucking review. Well, the only positive... See, even my body's reacting violently to it. Even my body's like, fuck this. Even my body's going, you know what? You ever see Dead Alive Peter Jackson when the guts came out and, you know, walked away? That's my guts. Are, everything in my body is just going to be skeleton and fucking skin. And the rest of it is going to walk away in disgust. It's just going to be this hunter fucking... Skeletor talking to you and going where the fuck where the fuck I was going with this I forgot where I was going with it I went off track but the if if I want that version I would have to pirate if I want it which is what you're against, but you're ripping people off. Which this is why people do that shit. I'm not saying I will. I'm not saying I won't. And if I did say I will, maybe I'll change my mind. Maybe it's just words, not actions. Maybe I'm just saying in a heated debate. But if I decided, I would have to in order to get what I paid twenty dollars for and didn't get. So yeah, this is a paperweight. This is a $20 paperweight. This is a $20 goddamn dollar paperweight. And even if I wanted to do it, I probably wouldn't find it to download. Even if I did find it to download, I wouldn't be able to do it because this fucking thing doesn't burn right. And then... So yeah, I got, I got tripped. I got my ass tripped. He got his ass tripped too because he bought the... Ali Minab, he bought the movie too. And he remembers seeing the movie. He's like, yeah, that was an hour and 35 minutes. So yeah, that's at least two people you ripped off. So to anyone who likes who the the 20 people among me who likes the movie, 
two people that are ripped off away, so we'll warn the 18 other people who liked the film, hey, by the way, you're not dead in the whole movie. These fucking websites, maybe they got paid off by Universal. Shh, shh, can you not mention that? So that you, we'll give you some payola since this movie bombed. You know, we'll, we'll slip a little bit of money so that, you know... To be honest, that's probably not what happened because Universal is too fucking stupid to do that. Twenty five goddamn minutes. I don't believe this bullshit. Again, it's not like I'm bitching because, oh, uh, I mean, I would complain if a minute and a half was taken out or anything, because, but 14 fucking minutes? 14 minutes? Are you shitting me? What the fuck? But anyway, I don't know what else I can say. I got ripped off. Fuck you, Universal. You go to University of Suck My Dick.